Hey, how's it going guys? It's me, your Death01 here, back with another video. This time it's going to be another glitch in Minecraft, except this one is going to be a villager trading glitch. Um, this glitch works both ways, so you can use this glitch to get emeralds, or you can use this glitch to get items from emeralds. As long as the, uh, the trade with the villager uh, requires multiple of the same item in the trade. So, just to show you guys real quick, uh, if you come up to this villager here, this armorer, as you can see, he uh, requires 16 coal to get one emerald. Now, the, the way this glitch is going to work uh, is very, very simple, trust me, uh, and they're probably going to patch it soon. So the way this works is, as you can see, he takes 16 coal for the trade to get one emerald. What you want to do is you want to have 16 coal in your, in your inventory, of course. But you're going to put one of the item in your hotbar and the remaining are going to be in your inventory or your backpack or whatever you want to call it. So uh, we have a stack of 64 coal here just, uh, just for simplicity. Um, we're going to put one in our hotbar. As you can see there we have just one in our hotbar and the remaining go in our inventory. Now when you go to trade the armorer, as you can see here, when we purchase the emerald right there. As you can see, it only took the one coal from our hotbar, and the uh, we still have 63 in our inventory. So, uh, even though the coal is required, it says 16, it only took one. And now you can do this up until the trade goes away, which I believe is seven trades. So, we'll do this again. As you can see, we traded one uh, from our hotbar, still kept the remaining in, in our inventory. As you can see, you can keep doing this up until the trade goes away. And like I said, I believe it's seven. Uh, so this glitch is very easy to do. It requires, you know, no skill, really. Um, and here we are in the seventh trade. And as you can see, the, uh, the trade went away now. And this glitch uh, also works in reverse. So you can, you know how you trade items to get emeralds generally from villagers and how they also have trades where you can use emeralds to buy items like this uh, iron helmet here. This glitch also works in reverse. So again, it's the exact same way. Uh, you have one in your hotbar, the remaining in your inventory, and it will only take the one from your hotbar uh, when, when you do the trade. So just for an example here, we have the seven emeralds we got from trading the coal. Uh, so you put one in your hotbar. The remaining are going to stay in my inventory. We're going to back out, come to the armorer there. And as you can see, there's the for iron ingots and all that stuff. And then when we come to the uh, iron helmet here, as you can see, it takes four emeralds for the trade. I don't know why you'd ever spend four emeralds to get an iron helmet. But... You come to the trade here, we have the one in our hotbar, the remaining in our inventory, and when you go to purchase it, as you can see, it only took the one emerald from our hotbar. And you can do this over and over, so again, we'll do it again. Put one emerald in your hotbar, or one of the item you want to trade for in your hotbar, the remaining stay in your inventory, or your backpack here. Come back to the trade, and as you can see, when we buy it right there, we have another iron helmet, and it only took the one from our hotbar. And yes, these are actual helmets. You can wear them, use them. Uh, the emeralds are real emeralds. You can craft them in the blocks. Uh, so we'll do this a little bit more just to get back some. So as you can see, again, you put the one in your hotbar. The remaining stay in your inventory. And uh, yeah, you just keep going. I think that was the last trade for it. Nope. Still do a couple more trades. And the more you do this, the more items the villager will have to offer. Uh, so make sure you do this a lot, and you know, might as well, might as well get your stack going. Um, and as you can see here, this this iron chest plate requires 13 emeralds. So you're gonna put the one in your hotbar, the remaining stay in your inventory, and when we go to buy it, as you can see, it only took the one. And uh, the amount of times you can do this glitch is dependent on uh, the amount of items you have on you uh, subtracting the amount it requires for the trade plus one uh, so if you have 40 let's say uh, we'll come back to this beginning trade you, you have uh, it takes 16 coal for one emerald you have 20 coal in your inventory using this uh, glitch you can now get 
uh, five coal or five emeralds from 20 coal. Because what's going to happen is, is it's going to use one every time. Um, so as you can see here, if we, uh, if we come over here, just put this coal away. So we need 20 coal, just so you guys can see. So we got 20 coal there in our inventory. It, it takes 16 for the trade. So you come over here. Uh, actually, let's get rid of these emeralds just so you guys can see. So again, the formula is amount of items required. Or the amount you have minus the amount you required plus one. That's how many uh, trades you can get off. So we have the one in our inventory, the 19 in our, or the one in our hop bar, 19 in our inventory. As you can see, we've got the one, one, do it again for two. Oh, the trade went away. Um, but yeah, you guys get the idea. So basically, it's just however many you have on you minus what the trade is plus one, and that's how many uh, you can get out of it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, make sure you like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Uh, I will try to be uh, finding. I'll try to find some more. Uh, as you can see, I, you know, I've been trying with anvils and tracks and dispensers and and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, keep tuned for that. If I find any more, I'll make sure to post them right away. Uh, I'm not sure if this has originally been found. I think it has been originally been found before. Uh, so if you guys know who found it first, uh, make sure you leave it in the comments below. I'll try doing some searching because I'm pretty sure this has been found before. So again, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you check out some of my other videos. Keep it real, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.